Western New York, as you know, has no shortage of fine art galleries. Always on the lookout for what's new in the world of art, Mike Randall checks out a new art gallery that just popped up. Artist and higher education professional, John Sauter, is now curator of an art gallery. I uh, built it in my garage. I had a whole bunch of reclaimed wood. The gallery is on the front lawn of his Amherst home. My saw is not very accurate, so it got a little smaller than I intended. John says he got the idea from a magazine article and thought that a free little art gallery could be a great showcase for his work. And decided, you know what, that would be really great because it merges my interest in art with, you know, kind of something that I can do here. John is assistant dean for academic affairs at Niagara University, where he also teaches a course on urban sketching. Uh, urban sketching is essentially like sketching from observation, um, but including the context and stories. The free little art gallery is available to all who would like to leave a piece of art or take one or both. It's been great to see all the like kids and families stopping by as they're on their strolls. Uh, there was one piece of art that popped in yesterday that was just with love from, you know, an address down the street. Free little art galleries have been popping up around the country. Word of John's version has attracted artists near and far. I've had probably had about seven, eight people uh, come in and, you know, request if they could send in art from different parts of the country. The installation here is changing daily. This is actually one of the busiest it's been in a while. The latest addition to the Free Little Art Gallery, art supplies. Everything you need to create a masterpiece right on the spot. Now all I have to do is think of something to draw. Hmm. You can keep up with the latest news of the Free Little Art Gallery at John's website. We'll post a link on our website. Meanwhile, he's always looking for a few good artists. You can drive up and, and come in. Ian Amherst, Mike Randall, 7. Eyewitness News.